So you have created a magazine spread within InDesign and this is part of a larger project. So if we actually go up here we can see that we've got um, a page forehand which is a advert. So we might have quite a few pages up here and maybe more down there. Uh, but all we're actually interested in is making a PDF of this. So how do we do that in InDesign? It's really simple. I'll show you. Go to File and Export. So down the bottom here we have Format. We have lots of different options, but PDF Print is one we're looking for because we're uh, recreating the magazine. And we're going to give it a name. So Trent Spread. Um, I'm going to give it a tag. So called uh, Cas. Um, on the Windows version, it's very similar. You can see it quite clearly. And click Save. It brings up this new menu. Now, you can do a lot here. And you can really get the output that you want. But the default settings are absolutely fine. So the first thing you do is make sure that you're setting on to range. Because if you set all, you won't get just these two pages that you're interested in. You'll get the entire booklet. So range. And then make sure you type in here the range you're interested in. Now by default, you'll probably have all pages. So just select this and just tootle three because this is page two and this is page three. If it was page four and five, it would be four and five and so forth. And then you want it done as spread because if you say pages, you will just get a page A4 on your PDF and then beneath that, another page. So make sure spreads um, is enabled. Everything else you can leave um, as default as I said, you know, we can also in page embed page thumbnails if you want to, but that's okay. So export. You might get something like this pop up, don't worry too much um, because we're not worried about links and URLs in our PDFs for this project. So click OK and in a few seconds you'll see. Um, let's have a look. There we are. I'm gonna double click here. We have a PDF double page spread. So there we are, we've created a PDF with two um, A4 pages of the spread and that is how to save your PDF from InDesign.